Welcome to this tutorial for Dehumanizer Live. If you haven't seen our previous videos, you can watch the main overview tutorial in the description of this video. Today, I'll be showing you how to implement the Krotos mic input into your Y session. The Krotos mic input is the perfect way to add processing to your dialogue in real time in your game. This is useful for vocal based communication and VR titles. To use the mic input, simply select the default work unit and choose the Sound SFX option. This will create a new instance of this in your WISE session. Select this new instance while you're in the designer layout in WISE. Then you will be able to see the contents editor window down here. Over on the right hand side of the contents editor window, you will find the option add source. By clicking on this, you will reveal a drop down menu which contains the Krotos mic input. Select this and it will be applied to your new sound S effect. Everything is now ready to use, and by pressing on the play button, you can activate the mic. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. By pressing the stop button, this will also stop the mic. By adding other Dehumanizer Live plugins, you can immediately apply processing to live dialogue. Once everything has been set up inside your session, it is now ready to be implemented into your game. Thanks for watching.